Next data set uh, we are going to study is disjoint set and it almost have some properties of the tree data structure okay that is why i am introducing it in this section and uh, the definition a disjoint set a data structure is a data structure that uh, takes a set of elements so partitioned into number of disjoint or non overlapping subset and uh, it provides a near constant time operation for the union of two sets and if to find whether an element is belonging to the same set or not okay so here are some disjoint set uh, the set s1 is equal to 1789 okay and we can represent it as a disjoint set data set like this and uh, you can see all the arrows are pointing towards the node 1 uh, this denote that um, node 1 is the root node okay and uh, next uh, disjoint set is 5 2 10 okay so these two sets are called kind of disjoint because they don't have any element in common and when we have one more set 3 4 6 and uh, this also does not have any element in common so this is called uh, disjoint sets okay and a disjoint set will have a root node and uh, all other nodes will be pointed to the root node okay so it can be represented as an array like this we will have the element i and its parent will be uh, given like this okay and if the parent is a root node we will give the value of parent as minus 1 okay so here you can see one is the root node so we give one is parent value as minus 1 and the node 2 node 2 is uh, in this set and its parent is 5 so we represented it like this okay and node 3 is a root node of this set so we give one is a uh, parent s minus 1 and node 4 parent node 4 parent is node 3 so it will be represented here okay this is how, how we will be represent every elements in a disjoint set using a two dimensional array okay now there are uh, mainly two operations happening in a disjoint set that uh, they are union operation and uh, find operation okay so uh, here you can see this uh, disjoint set 178 we have seen in this in previous slide okay and we are combining it with the disjoint set 5 to 10 okay so the union operation is just simply change the parent of one of the node either you can use choose node 1 or node 5 to set parent as other okay so here we set the parent of node 5 as node 1 okay so this is the union operation and uh, the find operation is quite simple in find operation what we will do is that uh, if suppose find of 8 find of 8 will return 1 because the parent node of the disjoint set that where 8 belongs to is 1 so it will return 1 and if if we perform the union like this find of 2 will return 1 okay so the find operation is uh, taking place in in a propagation like uh, find of Two will call find of five, and find of five will call a find of one. Okay, like that it will go. So these are the algorithms for the symbol union and the symbol find operation in disjoint set. And uh, let us see this in example. So here you can see. Uh, disjoint set uh, up to 0 to 15 16 disjoint set and uh, there is no union operation performed on them and all of them are uh, distinct uh, disjoint set okay so if i perform a union operation on sorry on 0 and 1 uh, the disjoint set is 0 and 1 then uh, definitely 1 uh, become the parent okay of 0 okay now uh, if i want to unite uh, this 1 uh, with 2 uh, this uh, disjoint set with 2 uh, then i can give either 0 union 2 so that 2 uh, will be union to the parent okay or you can give 1 union 2 also so that uh, that same result will, you will get okay and uh, suppose if i am taking union of 3 and 4 we will get another disjoint set and if i am combining 5 with them i will get uh, another disjoint set okay see so this is how the union operation of disjoint set uh, works and uh, so if i send the find operation for node 3 it should return node 5 okay 
so i hope you understood how the union and defined operation works okay now there is a drawback for this uh, union operation that um, suppose if i am performing the union operation 2 union 5 okay then you can see as in the binary search tree you can see the tree is growing uh, towards a side or uh, like uh, what we have done in the binary search tree okay that we have seen in the binary search tree that is if i am performing 5 union 6 okay then uh, it will come like this and if i am performing 6 union 7 yeah you can see the tree is growing towards in one direction or you can say the tree is going horizontally that is one of the disadvantages of disjoint set a normal or simple union operation now we will see the weighted union operation and a weighted find operation okay here the find operation suppose if i want to find whether the who is the parent of the node is zero then uh, it will execute uh, like this we have to explore all the possible nodes then only we can find the parent okay fine 